Today, Kevin and Andrew and I are going to be trying two completely random things, but these were sent to us from Dr. J in the United Kingdom. Thank you, Dr. J. So I decided just to put them together. These are Maltesers truffles, and Andrew has crunchy caramel M&Ms. It says pop it open. Limited edition. This is creamy, crunchy, truffly, and you get one, two, five. three, four, five, six. six. You get six. They are. It looks like 102 calories each. It says milk chocolate. Ooh, it's um, like a little bean pie. Milk chocolate with a malt filling, chocolate filling, and honeycombed pieces. I wonder if you could taste the honeycomb. Wow. Fill up. Fill up punches. There's two of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it wasn't very many. Gone. Mm. That's good. It's kind of dark and bitter for me, but. Dark? It has a, a bitter flavor to me. Um, that to me, all that is is a Yorkie. That is a thick milk chocolate. That's it. I, I got a little bit of crunch. Kevin has always been a fan. Uh, give, uh, if, if he has a choice between Maltesers and a malted milk ball, a Whopper, he would rather have a Whopper. I would always choose a Malteser. Um, like Whoppers. That's shoes you, I want a walk. You want a walk. I want the milk carton. Um, and I don't know if you remember. Do they but, still have a milk carton? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. but you and your dad did a blind taste test of the. They were these malted milk balls from the Dollar Tree, and you liked those better than Whoppers. Yeah, I like malted milk balls. You those like, are not. He liked, I would not even put those in the same category as a malted milk. Well, I I that's like a, these, but honestly, these are. They're pretty much plain Maltesers, I think. I don't think you taste the honeycomb. They made a little difference in the texture, the texture. but you didn't taste enough difference to, mm. to make them any different. No, I So, I don't know how They're much good. you paid I mean, for these, but. It's got a good texture. It's got a good creaminess to the chocolate. It's you know. thicker, it is thicker. Um, the texture, the whole texture is different. But I think you come away with the, the flavor, basic right? flavor that is the same. Yeah, see, I just get like a bit of chocolate kind of blur. Okay, these. 36 grams. Okay. Or 174. Yeah, we, we, we'll just enjoy it. And honestly, them. I didn't expect them to be all different colors. They are. These are the uh, crunchy caramel M&Ms. I just want that. They're crunchy. Mmm. I want to yeah. watch, yeah. watch what colors they pick. I don't even, I couldn't even tell you what color I picked. I can tell you what buck color you picked for. Really? Because I watched you. This was yellow, of course. What color was mine? Red. Did I really pick a red one? Mm -hmm. I always pick Gavin red. Gavin always picks red first, too. I know he does. <laughs> it's, it's his color. We're competing now for game ponds because I'm always, I'm the older one and I've always picked red. And so now he is. And Gavin red. loves red. And he won't give it up. Even for me, he won't give it up. So it's like. He'll be like, no, you can have this. This, the, those aren't what I expected mm -hmm. them to be. I didn't taste the caramel really. The, uh, they taste different than M&M's. They taste different than our caramel, mm -hmm. I think. Well, and our caramel. They're not it. They're not crunchy like yeah, that. Yeah, this has like a hard ball in the middle. Yeah, and coated in chocolate. Where ours is a really thick. It's like a piece of toffee. Yeah, Normal. sitting yeah. in the middle of a really, it gets in your teeth. I knew it would. Yeah, and it's chewy, and that's not the. It doesn't taste like an M&M. Mm -hmm. It's not bad. They're, I mean, it's, wrong, it's good. Right? No, you're right. It's okay. it's good. It's very very good. Yeah, it has um, a good flavor. It's not one I would buy all the time, but it does have a good flavor. Yes, it's not one I would buy all the time. So, uh, it's so kind of burnt. Kind of but I love getting to try it. Love getting to try something new always from the United Kingdom. I wouldn't turn them down for sure. It just wouldn't be one I would buy all the time. Uh, so, and the Maltesers, my favorites remain to be, I say this every time. The bunnies. The, yeah, the malt, uh, the malt Easters that come out at Easter and then the, the reindeer ones, whatever they call those. Um, they come out at Christmas in their reindeer. Those are my favorite ones. So anyway, thank you very much to Dr. J and thanks for watching.